नमस्ते आई निशु पांडे वेलकम एवरी वन ऑन द ब्रांड न्यू एपिसोड ऑफ साइंस बिट्स ऑन न्यू ऑन भारत आ फर्स्ट दिस सेशन इज ऑल अबाउट साइंस विच इज सिंप्लीफाइड इन सॉल्व क्रिस्प एंड यूनिक मैनर बाय द एक्सपर्ट साइंस बिट्स इन्वॉल्व एक्सप्लेनेशन ऑफ द टॉपिक रेजिंग फ्रॉम द रिसेंट ट्रेंड्स एंड डेवलपमेंट इन द फील्ड ऑफ साइंस एंड टेक्नोलॉजी टू डिस्कशन ऑन द प्रीवियस ईयर क्वेश्चन एंड पोटेंशियल कॉन्सेप्ट विच आर इम्पॉर्टेंट फ्रॉम द परस्पेक्टिव ऑफ कम्पिटेटिव एग्जाम भारत ऑफ प्रोवाइडिंग यू एन अपॉर्चुनिटी टू आस्क यू डाउट बाय द फॉर्म हुज लिंक हैज बिन प्रोवाइडेड इन द डिस्क्रिप्शन बॉक्स बिलो डू मेक यूज ऑफ दिस अपॉर्चुनिटी नाउ आई वुड लाइक टू वेलकम आवर साइंस एक्सपर्ट डॉक्टर टी वी वेंकटेश्वरन सर हु इज हेयर विद अर्स टू आंसर द क्वेश्चन डॉक्टर टी वी वेंकटेश्वरन सर इज अ सीनियर मोस्ट साइंटिस्ट एट विज्ञान प्रसार न्यू दिल्ली He is also the founder of India Science Wire. So let's begin the session with today's question. Today's question is: What is carbon technology, and is carbon itself a source of decarbonisation? One of the important challenge globally is uh, global warming, and the global warming is essentially because the uh, carbon dioxide levels in the atmosphere is going up. and uh, the uh, carbon dioxide at, uh, in the atmosphere is going up because of our industrial uh, uh, activities human activities the amount of carbon dioxide in the atmosphere is increasing every year and because of that we are having uh, global warming and we are fearing climate change so internationally we have all come together under the paris agreement and then we have said that uh, the uh, carbon dioxide emission will be slowly and steadily reduced one idea is to reduce to the extent that by 2050 now maybe people are talking about 2070 that uh, the carbon dioxide uh, into atmosphere will become zero what does it mean it doesn't mean that uh, uh, there will be no carbon dioxide production suppose if i have a industry which is uh, living out the uh, carbon dioxide i can do two things i can capture those carbon dioxide okay convert it into some solid and then uh, let's say bury it under the ground it's called carbon uh, sequestration so which essentially mean that i am producing carbon dioxide but i am not letting it go into the atmosphere so net zero the amount of carbon dioxide that actually i let out into atmosphere is zero or i may grow plants the plants will absorb carbon dioxide okay so by that uh, means uh, actually i am not letting the carbon dioxide go up growing a, a forest is called as a sink because you can sink the uh, carbon dioxide that you are producing uh, into this uh, uh, forest and not allowing it to go to atmosphere okay so that's the idea so for that uh, there are lots of technology that people are talking about like for example going to uh, uh, renewables uh, energy efficiency using electric vehicles okay and uh, 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 changing the way we are uh, uh, working including uh, use of hydrogen okay hydrogen fuel and so on these are all various ways people are talking about one of the way that uh, people are talking about is that what do i do with the carbon dioxide that is released like i said one of the simplest way is carbon to capture so the industry is letting out carbon dioxide capture it make it into solid okay and then store it in geological formation but then there are also other possibilities what okay uh, you can use bioenergy combustion what is it i take the carbon dioxide i can use the carbon dioxide to produce various products that is where uh, uh, carbon economy comes in so what can i do there is a industrial emission of uh, carbon dioxide okay so i can use that carbon dioxide uh, and produce methane so once i produce methane that uh, methane becomes a uh, uh, yeah, fuel okay i can use this carbon dioxide okay and i can convert that into a uh, solid carbon once i convert it into solid carbon i can use it to produce carbon nanotubes which is used in electronics aerospace and various areas including batteries okay or the bulk carbon i can use it for cement uh, uh, metal carbides steel making so the carbon i can use it in this way or 
i can uh, uh, do reformation of this uh, carbon dioxide and then i can get what is called a syngas so the syngas can become a fuel so basically what you are trying to do is that you are using a fuel which is producing carbon dioxide you are using the same carbon dioxide to produce fuel so basically you are doing uh, uh, recycling so when you are recycling uh, the amount of uh, carbon dioxide that you will put in atmosphere will substantially reduce right so this is called as carbon economy uh, one way we are uh, uh, addressing the climate change is to reduce the amount of carbon dioxide that is let into atmosphere is being produced okay the second is that whatever that is produced being produced can we uh, recycle it so that it doesn't reach atmosphere that is the uh, carbon economy that uh, people are talking about 